welcome back to spicy veg life today i ordered a bunch of nuts from nuts.com i haven't ever had any of their stuff and they had a spicy sampler so i decided why don't i try these so i haven't had any of these flavors yet i think there's about eight of them inside i'm just gonna randomly pull them out and try them and tell you how spicy i think it is how the flavor tastes all that good stuff and uh, i opened this but i did not open the samples inside i want to do that with you guys and yeah so we're gonna see how each of these tastes and their flavor and everything and i made sure that the ingredients didn't have anything in it that um i couldn't eat so let's get into it so the first one that we have here is the southern heat mix looks like that and the reason why i looked at the ingredients beforehand because they don't have them on the sampler pack if you get the big pack of these they see the ingredients but i wanted to check beforehand so i'm just gonna try a little bit of each of these so again this is the southern heat mix let's try a couple of these let's probably get some water to rinse everything down Mmm, that's good. I'm tasting some chili powder in here, and then they have peanuts as well that are coated in the seasoning. Probably wasn't a peanut. Probably a corn chip. Here's a peanut. It has a really nice flavor though. I like this. It has a kick. I wouldn't consider it spicy for me, but good. Tastes really good. Honestly, I'm just gonna rate them all, the spiciness level of all of them at the end because that'll be probably easier. But I will tell you the flavor of these. And this is pretty good. I don't want to get too full, so let's only try a little bit of each. I can always finish the bag later and order more. So these are Kujon peanuts. And they look like this in the bag. Let's try a little bit of these. And on nuts.com, I also ordered some walnuts, but they have a whole bunch of different nuts and candies. And they do have a vegan section of different snacks and stuff. So I just ordered this again. I just typed in spicy sampler and nuts.com and I ordered this. And they got to me literally the next day. I ordered it at night and it came in the next day. So I really appreciate that quick service. The box was so cute that it came in. And I really like their design for everything. The little nuts. And it's really bright and colorful. But anyway, let's try these Kujon peanuts. Wow. I was not expecting it to crack in my mouth like that. That's a nice crunch. You know what? I know it's not barbecue flavor, but it's giving me um, a reminder of barbecue sauce or barbecue seasoning, like barbecue chips, except it's barbecue peanuts, and it was really crunchy on the outside. That was good. I like that. So that's the Kujan peanut. Let's see what's next. It's a mystery. I just pull out things and then see how, see what I get. All right, buffalo peanuts. They look almost exactly like the Kujan peanuts. These are buffalo ones. So let's open that up and try some. I'm so excited. I'm just ripping these open. So, it smells like barbecue sauce. It's actually glazed. Okay.
That didn't taste like buffalo sauce at all. It tasted like a glazed peanut, maybe. Maybe it was mislabeled. That tastes exactly like if you go to the fan, they have the glazed peanuts. It's like buffalo, though. That was sweet. And look, they look, they look glazed. I don't know if you can see it. It looks glazed. I don't know. But let's move on. All right, wasabi peanuts. And they are very green. So I'm guessing it's coated in it. Coated in wasabi. Okay. Wow. That smells like wasabi. <laughs> all right. Wow. It's getting all up in my nose. <laughs> but it looks like this. Kind of scared. Oh, yeah. That's a wasabi peanut. Almost has the texture of um an M&M, &M, how it's in a shell, as if it's in a wasabi flavored shell instead of a chocolate shell. But it's not overwhelming. Like the wasabi wasn't an overwhelming flavor. I know sometimes I'll get um, avocado and cucumber rolls, and I'll just put a whole scoop of wasabi on it, and then I'm like, it goes all up my nose. <laughs> that horseradishy. Um, sensation but I didn't get that with this but you do taste wasabi but it's nice but when you open it it don't go up you know all right Ooh, we're on a wasabi kick right now <laughs> wasabi peas they look like peas in a coating so again we're gonna open that up yeah nice Opening. Okay, I can smell the wasabi in here, but not as strong as the peanuts. You can see their peas just coated. Oh wow! Oh, that has more of a wasabi kick than the peanuts do. Doesn't smell as intense. Um, and it's, I don't know why in my head I'm expecting some of these to be a little soft. They've all been crunchy, um, especially the peas. It was like a, it, it's almost like a biting, a crunchy shell. And then you taste those soft. Yeah. All right. Next, we have a Jericho Party Mix. There's so much in here. I am actually really enjoying this. So, like trying all these different flavors. All right. It smells like, um, just like a party mix right now. Hmm, okay. See that? It wasn't as crunchy as the other stuff. It was a peanut. There's peanuts. Some bees. Mmm. So far. I really like this one. Um. It has a really light flavor to it. Nothing too extreme like the wasabi peas. You could really taste the wasabi. This is subtle but gives it a nice flavor. I like it. Next, Pujon Sesame Sticks. So, let's try some of that and let me see. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think there's one more in this big bag after this. So these are kind of just like little breadsticks. Mmm. 
Yeah, they are. They're almost like. Not silly. But this is good. Put a snack on, just keep them going. You can only really taste the Kujan. So, it's Kujan Sesame Sticks. Ooh, I like these. Alright, but. What man? Put this aside and. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. I said I have one more. There is one, two, three, four more in here. All right. So, ooh, these are pistachios. So, chili lemon pistachios. Which I've had this in, um, I've had it in a different brand before. And I was a fan of these. So, let's try this as well. Okay, I'm gonna crack it open. Okay. So, the only thing with me and nuts are and what pistachios are one of my favorites but I'm not a fan when I have to crack them open I feel like it's so much work for a little bit of flavor of these though they're good they're really good all right let's move on to the next one this is wasabi beans so it's a bunch of different beans Coated in wasabi. So we have wasabi peas, we have wasabi peanuts, and then we have wasabi beans. So let's try some of this. Ooh, they're all coated. And I see red and green. Yeah, okay. Wow, they like shells, but just like with the peas. You can taste it. I honestly like the wasabi flavor on these beans compared to the peas and the peanuts. Yeah, I really liked it on those. All right, two more left, and then I'll give you guys an overall view. So, this is Indian Summer Mix. Snacks for days, guys. Snacks for days. Wow. I don't know what these are. What is this? It's like a bunch of things in here. Uh, I don't want it to fall. Okay. This looks like one of those sticks that they got over here again. Yeah. It tastes like it. Mmm. Tastes like chucks. Test mix. Honestly, that tastes exactly like it. I don't really taste any flavoring. But maybe my mouth is run from having all this wasabi. My mouth is expecting wasabi, and it's like that wasn't it. All right, and the last one, Kujan corn sticks. Let me show you the back and the front. All right. Let's try some Kujan corn sticks. What were the other corn sticks that we had? Uh, I don't know, but they were pretty good. So this is corn sticks with Kujan flavor. Mmm, I really like this. I was about to say they taste kind of like Fritos, but they're corn sticks, so of course, they have that same flavor, that same texture, but the flavor of the fusion on these is nice. I like how it's mixing together. Okay, I gotta eat a couple more. Like, it's really good. All right. So, so far, or out of all of them, not so far. I finished this. this is, it's empty. Um, out of all of these, this one's my favorite. The Kujan corn sticks. 
I don't know. But then again, I like um, I like corn chips, so I think that's why. If you don't like corn chips, then you probably won't like these. But I do like these corn sticks and the Kujan flavor. I can tell you right now, as for spiciness with all of them, I I didn't find any of them to be super spicy um, at all. They have nice flavors and some of them have nice kicks like this one does and of course the wasabi does. Uh, but nothing really spicy at all. But flavor. Flavor's good. This one's my favorite. Um, my least favorite was the buffalo peanuts. And I think that's because I don't think they are buffalo peanuts that I got. I don't know. Maybe, maybe they are. Maybe it was just that one. They tasted like they were glazed peanuts. So I don't know. But that one was my least favorite um all the wasabi ones let me get those out so we had wasabi beans wasabi peanuts and wasabi peas and i would say um the wasabi beans were my favorite and then the peas and then the peanuts so if i'm grouping those together that's over here because i'm still winning right now <laughs> Um, the chili lemon pistachio. Good flavor, but like I said, I'm not a fan of cracking the nuts because I feel like it's so much work for such a little amount you get. So, good flavor, but if you don't mind cracking them open, um, they'll probably be higher up on your list than I have them. So, I'm going to put them in between the wasabi peas and peanuts. What else? We have the Indian summer mix. And that didn't really have any flavor um outside of what was already in here so i'm honestly gonna line it up with the chili lemon and pistachios um and actually i think all the wasabi ones are above that one <laughs> so all right the jericho party mix i don't remember how it tasted let me try it again <laughs> I'm pretty sure I like this one. I want to make sure I'm not confusing it. Yeah, this one's pretty good. Um, I'd put it up here, right behind the wasabi beans. So that's the Jericho Party mix. And then I have the Kujan sesame sticks, which are also really good. Not as good as the Kujan corn sticks, but almost. So that's second. All right, we're gonna look at the top three when I'm done. All right, so we have Southern Heat Mix, Kujan Peanuts. So, hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. You know what? Let me try it again. So this is the Kujan, or this is the Southern Heat Mix. I know, this review's all over the place. Okay, good in front of the wasabi, still behind the Kujan sesame sticks, and let's see about the Kujan peanuts. Maybe, I'm starting to think I'm just biased towards the Kujan flavor, but um, if I remember correctly, these crunched. Yep. All right. And actually, I put them behind the wasabi beans, but in front of the wasabi peas and Jericho mix. So my top three in order is the Kujan corn sticks. That one's really good. The Kujan sesame sticks. It's a good second for me. And the Southern heat mix. Yeah, I can still taste it. It's pretty good. So those are my top three. And I hope that you enjoy. Hopefully next time I'll be able to try something spicy as well, or a challenge, something fun. I like doing these videos, um, and of course I like rating stuff that are supposed to be spicy. So I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time on Spicy Veg Life. Bye.